Hey guys, and welcome back to Carrier. When we last left off, we had uh, searched the main deck, the top deck, I should say. We found out that our brother is stationed somewhere on the third deck, and we've re rescued two more survivors, which was a little bit strange. We found out that there's some virus called the Ark that seems to have uh, caused this tale of woe and we've also been given a card to get into the weapon storage room we've also been cleared to use explosives these are all good things so let's try and find the explosive room or the weapon storage room shall we now let's have a look around i'm really digging this game i really am i i'm frustrated that i've never played this game before but I'm also, oh hey, I'm also quite happy to find another survival horror game that I've never played before. Oh, you guys are hard to hit. Right, he's done. We're injured again. Okay, these guys don't do a huge amount of health to us, uh, health damage to us. I mean, they do enough, don't get me wrong. But they're not too bad. Right, he's, oh shit. Come on. Right. Is that it? Just those two? Yeah, it looks that way. Kind of hard. A bit of a dick move to actually uh, <laughs> hit us with those guys. Kind of sly game. Kind of sly. Okay. So, let's keep going down. Oh. What is... What? Oh, shit. Got invisible guys. He only took one bullet. Alright. Let's keep going. Now the fact that those guys don't bubble away. Whoa! Whole crew room. Oh fuck. Help me! It's going to kill me! It's a <laughs> Was the patient Don't let it fool you, son! It's going to kill me! Uh. Uh, so which one of these? Which one of these? You're safe. You're the danger. No. Can we... Can we aim? Please? There we go. Oh, fuck. Get off me. Oh, it's a good thing you're able to figure it out. How you doing? I'm Alan. I'm Sergeant Ingalls from okay. Spark. I'm asking all survivors to go to the flight deck. You should go there too. The flight deck? <laughs> there are no safe places left on this here ship. Well, you must have noticed by now the whole ship is screwed Little up, bit. son. It's impossible to tell who's on our side and who's not. not. Really. You can't trust anyone but yourself. That means you too. Thanks. But I'll make my own decisions. That's how you want it. Good luck. I've got work to do. Be careful. You too. Here, you better take this. By the way, son, thanks for saving my butt. Ooh, level three energy drink. Okay, so I just saved your ass, but you're not going to believe me. I mean, that's fine. I can understand that. Are you dead? Oof, God knows. Well, we're pretty injured. So, I guess that's going to be a thing in this game. Trying to work out who's good and who's not. Now, what have we got here? Another activation disc. Nice. Cool. Now, he hasn't bubbled away, so system is down, cannot be used. So, I'm guessing these guys aren't actually permanently down then. Right, let's have a little look. So, we're right the way over there. Okay, pilot prep room, we've been through. We haven't been through the magazine yet. The magazine... 
Could the magazine be a storage room? Not sure. Or the weapon room. I mean, the magazine generally is where they store the musician, uh, musicians, the munitions for the actual ship itself, for the main weapon systems. Okay, we're clear. At least I think we're clear. Kind of hard to tell. Right. Okay, so let's keep going this way for now. Alright, how did I get that other view? There was another view that I got up earlier. There we go. Ah. So there's... Definitely going to be... Oh, God. Been through all of that. All right, cool. Let's keep going. Let's keep going all the way back over. See if there's more people to save. Maybe that we can get like a better ending. Depending on... Oh, God. Depending on how many guys we actually save. Maybe that's a thing. Oof. You dead. I saw you twitch. I saw you twitch, motherfucker. Nah, he's down. He's down for now, at least, anyway. Okay. So, at least one thing. We can hear them. Might not necessarily be able to see them, but we can hear them. We haven't been through here yet. So we have the two activation discs. Well, this area is clear. Kind of. What about through here? So as soon as we go into these into a new room. What is danger? Okay, you. Ooh, shit. So we've got like weird bugs. Oh, shit. Run, run, dude, run. Right, okay, let's try killing you. Is there anything else here that we can hit? Okay, it's kind of hard to hit these things. Uh-oh. Hello? Oh, goody gumdrops. You yeah, this, pal? Let's drop you. Get out of here. Right, his head's popped. I should waste him. What used to be one of the crew members. Yeah, he's fucked up pretty bad. There's like nothing else here. What? What's weird is there's these butterflies on the guy. We don't have any kind of melee attack either, which is strange. Uh, I find it odd that there's like a little locked room there. Or what seems to be a dead end. Oh. Ah. You're a bit of a strange fellow, aren't you? Come on, bring him down. Bleed. So, can't tell. Can't tell if enemies randomly respawn or if there's just X amount of them. Not really sure what's going on with that. Ah, right, so this is the weapon room. Nice. Ah, and there's a save room here. So the magazine is the save room. Uh, the weapon storage room. Interesting. Let's dump another save in here. Cool. We've got a fairly good um, T 
some bomb. Nice. We've got a fairly good variety of enemies here. I mean, they're all zombies. I mean, the invisible ones are a little bit odd. Three pistol magazines. Nice. What I do like... Empty. Is the fact that you can... Even though you can't see the enemies, you can hear them. That's cool. Oh, nice. Six magazines. Don't mind if I do. Weapon storage locker. Yeah, but I guess there's nothing in there. Nothing. Do we get any other weapons? I mean, I guess so. Energy drink. Nice. Starting to slowly burn through those, so that was welcome. Come on, guys. Come on. Have another weapon. I mean, you know, good... Maybe not give us another weapon. I mean, six magazines, I suppose, is quite nice. What's that bring us up to? 109 rounds. Yeah, not bad, to be fair. Not bad. So, let's have a little look at our map. So, if we go back through... If we go back through the pilot prep room, which is one door down. There was a locked door there. I'm guessing the flashing um, rooms are where we've got to go to. Let's save it now we've... Yeah. Give it a save now we've actually managed to loot the place. Enemies don't seem to be too bad. Uh, health does seem to be fairly plentiful. However, I'm pretty sure that's probably going to change. Alright, so we can hear zombie like moans, but there's nothing here. Got you. That's creepy. Yes, sir, I like it. Another look through here. Get the old scanner majig out. Looks like we're clear for now at least. Now where were we going? There's a door there. Alright, let's go through there. There's like a big pile of giblets on the middle of the floor there. It seems to be uh, collecting weird bug type things. Oh. Okay, so we can kind of aim up a little bit. Not bad. Not bad. Let's keep going. There could still be stuff in there, but I'm pretty sure we examined it fairly thoroughly. Alright, not bad. Now, where are we going from here? So, if we go through the door behind us, through A1, and keep pushing. Really? That surprises me. Oh, we got hostiles. We got hostiles. Where? Where? Where is it? Come on, you little tosser. Where are you? Don't make me come in and get you. Because I'd rather not. Ah, oh, you little fucktard. Danger. Oh, there you are. Alright, let's bring him down. Come on, Jack. Oof. Melted. Definitely more, though. Absolutely not alone here. Can we go for his head, please? 
Yes, we can't go for his head. Oh, you sod. Go watch these guys, man. Jesus. Okay. So, what have we got here? Pilot prep room, right, briefing room. That sounds like somewhere that we probably should have a little look at. Now, we can go right round, but let's see if we can check out the briefing room first. Is this place going to be, like, full of hostiles? Object. Okay, looks like we've got some stuff in here, which I would have thought we would have. There is a slot for a DV. Ah, we've got a DV tape. a level one emergency sound the alarm during a level one emergency <laughs> the emergency locks are all activated to deactivate the locks you need a code number steve here take this memo steve. the locks can be deactivated with this number steve we are going to shoot the heimdall prepare to evacuate immediately going to something the heimdall blow it up so we know we need a Code. All right. So we're gonna get an energy drink. Nice. Definitely could have used that. So what we've got here: mission orders to James McGregor, commander of the Heimdall, from John Rowland, commander TNA Central. Begin your attack on the Southern Cross base using the. NFU-036 unmanned attack craft on the morning of April 1st. So yeah, just in the morning, you know. In conjunction, send in a Special Forces 1st Division to point th to a point three kilometers west of the Southern Cross Alpha Base to begin their attack at 1500 hours. Right, so we're going to airstrike them in the morning and then wipe them out at 3 o'clock. Yeah. <laughs> in the afternoon with the 1st Division. Okay, the 3rd Infantry vi Division will bring the mission to an end. The Heimdall and the Special Forces 1st Division are then ordered back to North America. So there's a whole division of troops here. Reference, the Southern Cross. There are rumours spreading that a country in the South su uh, supports the Southern Cross. Well, yeah, probably. With the increase in tension between North and South, the Southern Cross has become one of the largest anti-North terrorist groups. 2008, a meeting of the leaders of the developed nations, it was decided that a technical aid, that all technical aid and foodstuffs from the north to the south would be restricted in order to preserve the economic stability of the north. 2010, as a result of the policies of the north, the food shortage and unemployment problems in the south become more serious. Soon, several anti-north terrorist organizations begin to grow. 2013, the G77 consisting of 77 countries in the Southern Hemisphere, criticised the UN and the countries of the North on economic and moral grounds. 2014, several of the independent terrorist organisations in the South merged to form the Southern Cross. There is a military conflict between the US and Colombia. The US assumes a military uh, posture and the North-South problem is redefined as the US G77 crisis. 2018, despite resistance from the G77, the US builds a base in uh, Mombzambi Zambi? with the support from the UN in response to the Southern Cross Southern Cross instigates several terrorists attacking uh, against the US, including an attack on the American Embassy. Okay. Alright. Oh, a hello, the fucking creeper. Uh, Stop! I'll kill you, every one of you. Calm down, you're losing it. What? I'm okay. I. Friends, mutants. I killed them all. Uh, you killed your friends? 
You can't tell whether or not they're mutant unless you shoot them first. What? But he was human. I killed my best buddy. It's okay. You were in an incredibly stressful situation. Oh, I don't need your pity. My hands are covered with blood. Oh, I don't care what happens. Just, just leave me alone. Oof. Don't be stupid. You have to think only about uh. living. Regardless, you have to go to the flight deck and wait for help to come. If I feel like it, you... Why don't you just go and leave me alone? Uh... Okay. Hey, are you like... Are you safe? You are safe. Alright. Leave me alone! Yes, boss. I shall leave you here in the corner, like the creeper that you are. Very strange gentleman. Uh, okay, anything else in here? Doesn't look like it. Well, we've nicked all your stuff, dude, so... <laughs> Just saying. This is a very bizarre game. It's cheesy as all hell. I love it. Alright, let's go this way. I mean, you know, we are making progress. Making our way around the ship. Oof. Hey, friend. Ooh. You got a big throat tentacle, buddy. Don't trust those throat tentacles. Alright, looks like we've got another one. It's more like a mouth tentacle, actually. Alright, there we go. Aim for the face. Aim for the face. Boom! Get out of here. Alright. Alright, looks like we're good. Now, the controls are actually quite nice in this game. It's got to be said. An iron gate looks like it would take a bomb to get it open. Uh, well, you know, maybe like blow it open with a bomb then. You know, just just thinking out loud. What's in here? Nice. Okay, might be another mun munitions room. Catapult control room. Oh, you're an invisible dude. Won't be having any of your shenanigans, pal. Right, he's done. So, what have we got here? Activation disc one. We got all the activation discs yet? I think so. This screen shows the flight deck. That is one hell of a flight deck. You know, this uh, game is kind of reminding me um, of the kind of mask or old sort of Transformers kind of vibe going on. And it's really freaking cool. Right, so let's use our bomb to blow this gate open. So use... How do we use the bomb? We have to equip it. Can we cut? Like how? I know. Well, I mean, uh, that's kind of sad. We got twenty of these things. Oh God. Uh, that thing's pretty freaking juicy. We've got 20 of them. Alright. It's not... Ah, oh, that just leads us back to here. Cool. Okay. Now, where's our dude? He was in here, wasn't he? The one that wanted the discs. There he is. Can I, like, look at you? You are safe. Good. I'm not saying I don't trust you, but I don't trust you. Right. Uh, do I not have everything I need? Security system. Wait. Am I missing some? Ah, right. Okay. No, you're you are in here, but. That's not where we need to go. Right, we're on 25 minutes here, and uh, I think it's time for me to end the episode. 
just because missus is about to be home soon and uh that's gonna be the last of my recording for this week sadly um right when we come back i guess we're gonna go to one of these two areas so we've got the binder here memos discs all right what about items have a look. Activation disc one and two. We only needed two discs, didn't we? To activate the partition lock on deck one. Yeah. Okay, so when we come back, we should be good to go. So, I hope you guys are enjoying this game. This game is really fun, actually. And I'm enjoying it one hell of a lot. I can't wait to start playing it again. Uh, well be next week now but uh yeah so thank you very much for watching guys and as always till next time